It's the radio guy, Mike Prince. Welcome to another episode of the Mike Prince Show. Follow me on Twitter at the Mike Prince Show. Follow me on YouTube at the Open Mic Broadcast Network. Don't forget, visit our website at obnradio.com. We'll jump right into today's episode. I want to thank you guys so much for joining in with us. We truly, truly appreciate you and we can't do it without you. Well, of course, we had reflect on who we thought were the coaches that had the most to prove for the 2022 football campaign coming up. Now it's going to lead us to the coaches that we believe entering the 2022 season are coming in on the hot seat. Now, there's a difference in having something to prove than being on the hot seat, at least from our vantage point. So we'll jump right into it. There's only two coaches that we have that would really, 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 from the way we see things, be on the hot seat. And we'll start off in the east of the Southwestern Athletic Conference, and that is Terry Sims of Bethune Cookman. Bethune Cookman is coming off a two and nine inaugural season, entering to the Southwestern Athletic Conference. Very uncharacteristic of a Terry Sims led football team. Why is he on the hot seat? Well, we know that there is a slightly new athletic director at Bethune Cookman, and you could never tell what is on the mind of the new boss. And this would be the year or poop or get off the pot for Coach Terry Sims and the Bethune-Cookman Wildcats. So we'll be monitoring that situation very, very close to see exactly how that pans out for Wildcat Nation this coming fall. From the west of the Southwestern Athletic Conference, believe it or not, we're going to say Doc Gamble would be one on the hot seat for the University of Arkansas at Pine Bluff. Not long ago in the spring football episode, Pine Bluff played for the championship, fell short to Alabama A&M. Now, things have been totally scattered, it at least appears, from outside looking in. And Doc Gamble having a lot to make up for and what seemed to be a down spiral of the Golden Lions program. Can they rebound? Will they rebound? I think if it's going to be the time, now is for Doc Gamble and the Golden Lions. So those are our two coaches that are on the hot seat as far as the Southwestern Athletic Conference is concerned. Now, Of course, I have to have an honorable mention, correct? And even though we think they are going to be headed in a very strong, strong upgrade, you got to keep a focus and got to keep an eye on two teams who I actually figure are going to do pretty decent this year. But if it doesn't work out, they two could find themselves on the hot seat and that is none other than Mississippi Valley Vincent Dancy and Texas Southern Tigers Clarence McKinney now I got all the confidence in those two guys and I think they're going to actually do pretty good this season but the fan base we know that our fan base can be very very special So let us know what you guys think. Do you think we're on target or we're way off base? We'd love to hear from you on the 24-hour message line, 713-570-6736. Or you could leave a comment on Twitter at The Mike Prince Show and our YouTube channel at The Open Mic Broadcast Network. My time has come where I must exit stage left. I am the radio guy, Dr. Mike Prince. And until the next time, you guys be blessed. And we'll see you on the other side.